Old City Hall, Toronto, from Wikipedia, the Free Encyclopedia, http colon slash slash en dot wikipedia dot org. Toronto's Old City Hall was home to City Council from 1899 to 1966 and remains one of the city's most prominent structures. It is at the corner of Queen and Bay Streets, opposite the new City Hall in the center of downtown Toronto. It has a distinctive clock tower which can be seen the whole length of Bay Street from front to Queen. Work on the Romanesque Revival Building designed by E. J. Lennox began in 1889. Lennox, quote, signed, quote, his name in a scroll work around the first floor exterior. When it opened on September 18, 1899, it was the largest building in Toronto and the largest municipal building in North America. Toronto City Hall moved to the new City Hall in 1965, and soon after, plans were made to start construction of the Eaton Centre. The original plans called for Old City Hall to be knocked down and replaced by a number of skyscrapers, leaving only the cenotaph, or in one plan, the clock tower, in the front. Public outcry forced authorities to abandon these plans, and today the building is the home of the municipal courts. An annex to this building, Manning Chambers, was demolished to make way for the current Toronto City Hall. At the foot of the front steps on Queen Street is the Cenotaph, erected to honor the dead from World War I and World War II during Remembrance Day ceremonies every November 11th. The building is sometimes used to film movies and television shows, such as This is Wonderland. This sound file and all text in the article are licensed under the GNU Free Documentation License, available at www.gnu.org slash copyleft slash fdl.html.